Good morning to the Acting Headmaster, Mr. Stipple, members of the executive and senior management teams, directors, grade heads, house tutors, HODs, academic, administrative and support staff, learners and invited guests. Once upon a time, long, long ago, I had a dream. And as we know, all stories begin with a dream. And my dream was to become a lawyer. My dream, however, was short-lived as my mum and dad successfully convinced me to become a teacher instead. To my late mum and dad, on this historic day, I wish you were here today to witness the conclusion of your dream for me, which ultimately became my passion and brought me full circle. Everyone has a story to share. Every one of us looks back on a coach or a teacher or a family member or some person who has set us straight and steered us right. We're all destined to leave some kind of mark. I really believe that. We're all meant to walk a certain path at a certain time, in a certain direction for a certain purpose. I believe that too. In fact, the very respect my mum so valued and constantly instilled in my brother and I became my mantra when I started my teaching career at Work School Port Natal in Durban. A journey that then briefly took me to the National School of the Arts, Wurschkuhl de Kroen, and ultimately, in 1991, brought me to Parktown Boys High School, a place I to this day and eternally will call home. I'm convinced now more than ever before that monastic schools and Parktown Boys High School in particular produces men who are poised, confident, articulate and well-rounded because the school provide you with the following. A place where you can be a boy and learn and mature at your own developmental pace. Avenues to release your boundless energy in a healthy and constructive way. Opportunities to express your creativity without it being a threat to your masculinity camaraderie, loyalty, friendship, and teamwork, boundaries and discipline, tradition and heroes, a sense of belonging, loyalty, and pride. I've had the immense honor of teaching thousands of Parktonians 
over three decades, which embodied these critical aspects. None more so than the following individuals that eventually became my colleagues. Head boy of 1998, and now acting headmaster, Mr. Stipple. Head boy of 1999, and now director of discipline and HOD of life orientation, Mr. Fonsale. Acting head of recruitment, HOD of history, history and MIC of hockey, Mr. Furlong, House Tutor of Tuscans, Mr. Vessels, MIC of Rowing, and Business Studies teacher, Mr. Robson, MIC of Cricket, and Social Sciences teacher, Mr. Reddy, and Mathematics and AP Mathematics teacher, Mr. Quiroga. What a privilege it was to, in some small way, have contributed to the education of these remarkable Poptonians. On this day, I would especially like to thank every learner I have ever had the opportunity to meet or teach. I am immensely proud of you all. Go out there and make a difference if you have not done so yet. Protest, speak out, get involved. Remember that you are from Parktown Boys High School. This is what we do. It is expected of you. Rest assured that I will always treasure the school as a keystone in my development as a leader. But I also believe that my retirement now help pave the way for the next generation of leadership. Thank you. It has been an honor and a privilege to be a member of the Parktown Boys High School family. There are no goodbyes for us. Wherever I may find myself, my heart and soul will fervently remain with the school. May God bless you all and keep you safe. I thank you.